Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Miranda. If you're new here, welcome. On this channel, we do all things budgeting, budget with me's, cash stuffing, savings challenges, things like that. So if that is something that you are interested in, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and follow along on this journey with me. So today we're going to be my week two spending tracker to see how much I've spent, if I've stayed on budget, Okay, so what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to color code everything the best as I can and kind of keep track of how much I'm spending in each category. That way I can adjust my budget as needed in the future. So we'll start with bills. Let me get out my highlighters here. Put them over here to the side. So bills, looks like the only one I had was my Jeep payment. And usually I pay that when I first get paid, but I had totally forgotten, so I paid it for on this week. Okay, so for bills, down here at the bottom, I write how much it was in all. So it was 540 for bills. Okay, so food. Oh, you know what? Actually, I count gas is in my bills binder, so we're gonna change that to 580. I know it's not really a bill, but it's in my bills binder, so that's kind of why I'm gonna do it that way. So 580. Okay, so food. We've got this one here. We have this one and this one. I did pretty good with not eating out. I didn't buy groceries this week. That helped a lot as well. So for Food, we've got, let's see, 17 plus 10, 80 plus 6, and that is 33, 80. Okay. I'm trying to get better about not eating out as much, um, which I did really good with not eating fast food. Being a teacher, I'm tired when I get off, so a lot of times I just hit a fast food restaurant on the way home. And so I've been trying really hard not to do that. Um, and then the water burger, I did that after my neurologist. I had a half day at work, so I went to my neurology appointment and then I got food after. Otherwise, I would not have even gotten that. So now let's do low priority. I need to find a way to kind of hone in on these categories and like when I'm when I'm tracking it like this because low priority, you know, I do different categories inside of my low priority, like household and um, health, okay? School, all of those are in my low priority binder, but they all get a different amount. So I'll have to find a better way to do that. And I just saw another, another one that I consider bills. So I'm already not off to a great start here. So monthly subs was my Amazon. Let me just make sure I don't have any other. Okay, so 580 plus 1623. So that's actually, we're just gonna make it all sloppy here. That is actually 596.23. Okay, there we go. So for low priority, I had 16 for household. Whoops, 16 for household plus the 70 from my neurology appointment. That was my copay. Whoops, I cannot work this calculator today, guys. Oh my gosh, okay, 16 plus 70 plus 684. Okay, there we go. So 9284 for low priority. And most of that came from my copay at the neurologist. And then unexpected, we had Sam's. I had to buy a new TV. I had my Pinterest um, ads that I did to help promote some of my products and my YouTube videos. I guess it's not really unexpected, but I just have that as unexpected, like if I didn't budget for it. Okay, so Sam's, I had 259 and then 5083. Whoops. Okay, 259 plus 5083. There we go. Plus 572. 
So 300, 15, 58. And I did pull some for that Sam's for my new TV. I did pull some money from savings that I'm going to pay myself back for. Okay, and then pets. We had one pets here and that was 47, 47, 63. So that is everything I, I bought for this week. So this is going from Friday to Friday. And when you're seeing this, it should be Wednesday. So this is for last week. And so I did better with the spending as far as not spending, not like using a whole page. However, there were some unexpected things that kind of put me out of budget. So let's see how much we spent this week and it's gonna be way too much, you can already tell. So 596.23 plus 33.80 plus 92.84, oh my gosh. I am not doing well with this calculator today, guys. 33.80 plus 92.84 plus 315.58 plus 47.63. Wow, so spent way more this week than last week. However, let's see, I'm gonna subtract my Jeep payment and the 259 for the TV and see how much we actually spent. So really, if it wasn't for that bill and um, having to unexpectedly get a new TV, I would have only spent 200, about $287. So that's not near as bad once you take those things off of there. Did I stay in budget? No, not really. But this gives me a good idea at how I can adjust my budget next month and kind of see where I need to add more money to, um, things like that. Now, I don't know if these are very helpful for you guys, but at least you can kind of see how I'm trying to track and adjust my budget. And this really helps to keep myself accountable when I am posting this and showing you guys all of this. But yeah, that is all for this video. As always, if you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and don't forget to comment down below. I love hearing from you guys. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. We are so close to a thousand subscribers, which is my goal for the end of this year. So I would love it if you guys followed, followed along on this journey with me and I will see you in the next one. Bye.